Our reading this morning is from Colossians 1 verses 15 to 23 where Paul describes in amazing glory who Jesus is to him and should be to us. The Son is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn over all creation. For in him all things were created, things on heaven and on earth, visible and invisible, whether thrones or powers or rulers or authorities, all things have been created through him and for him. He is before all things, and in him all things hold together. And he's the head of the body, the church. He's the beginning and the firstborn from among the dead, so that in everything he might have the supremacy. For God was pleased to have his fullness dwell in him, and through him to reconcile to himself all things, whether things on earth or things in heaven, by making peace through his blood shed on the cross. Once you were alienated from God and were enemies in your minds because of your evil behavior. But now he's reconciled you by Christ's physical body through death to present you holy in his sight without blemish and free from accusation if you continue in your faith established and firm and do not move from the hope held out in the gospel. This is the gospel that you heard and that has been proclaimed to every creature under heaven and of which I, Paul, have become a servant. Let us pray. Father God, we are so grateful that you cared enough for us in our darkness to send your son to show us the likeness of yourself in a way that we can understand. We thank you Lord that we are no longer alienated from you. We can approach you with joy and peace knowing that you understand us. We pray it in Jesus' name. Amen.